it has been raining for three days straight so what happened to uh, our cabbage it got too wet and the uh, initial leaves started to uh, become yellow and rot so we did not have any other choice but to uproot them before it causes any problems but uh, even though they got rotten because of too much rain we still could uh, take the leaves that we can eat it's a pity because it was starting already to close up into cabbages so uh, yeah but it happens but we don't stop doing this thing because uh, uh, of these problems yeah, even the, the cauliflower because of the heavy rains it started to rot because it was too wet see it's a pity but uh, we could still salvage uh, a big part of the, the flour that we're going to prepare for this midday but well that's the reason why when it's rainy season the prices of your ordinary crops shoot up but uh in organic farming it, it happens as well so prices like uh we sell before um uh french beans for uh 30 pesos per 100 grams but because of the difficulty of the weather because of the weather uh prices shoot up as well so what's going to happen is we need to up the price to 50 pesos per 100 grams but that's how it is so uh let's just wait for the weather to improve so that prices will go down uh, here we are again in the heko Bakrat farm uh, two weeks ago we planted one of our price crops which we call arugula now uh, after two weeks you can see the result they are doing well as you can see they are you're getting some body see and you can be sure they're very tasty uh, this crop arugula usually we eat that together with lettuce or with tomatoes or so uh, but this is not a salad uh, this actually is a cabbage crop so uh, that's why we put it on our plot here where we plant first the cabbage crops and later on once we're going to rotate we are certainly not going to plant the cabbage crop here but something else that let's say a probably a, a uh, some beans which uh, uh, <coughs> bring some uh, nitrogen into the soil or, or some other crop that was of a, of a different family I just finished planting our kale today kale is a cabbage crop and uh, in a lot of literature it is recommended for its health properties there's a lot of antioxidants which is good to build up our immune system and people who know about kale because kale is not too well known here in the Philippines but people who know about kale here they they like to buy it so it sells quite well to that kind of people Hello, we are here at our aquaponics area harvesting our second to the last fringe beans. You can see still, they are still very beautiful. But by next time it will not take long anymore, we have to uproot them because uh, to avoid uh, how do you put that, sickness for our plants to infiltrate here in the aquaponics area. So uh, the French beans that uh, Mama and Papa just harvested is uh, equivalent to uh, three-fourths kilos. So 
at your regular market, uh, French beans sell at 60 pesos per 100 grams. So this would be uh, 750 grams. So times 60. So that's going to be 450 pesos. Imagine for uh, a small mountain of French beans like this, it's already 450 pesos. So we are very lucky to have our own here at the Echo Backyard Farm.